so Sarah Kane's one of my favorite writers. Like, I love Sarah Kane. But I feel like Sarah Kane's humor is so abject that, like, Americans are like, what is this? And I think that, like, you know, and I think what she was working with was, like, you know, looking at gender and, like, mental illness and, like, wanting us to see, like, the, like, the sort of putrid, like, um, nature of, like, you know, like, what we've done with that, over, like, over millennia. Um, she just punched you in the face with it. And I was like, I think... I, think, I don't think Americans like to be just punched in the face. Like, I think you had to sort of, like, um, give some honey to Americans and then punch them in the face. And so I think I'm doing that a little bit with the play. I'm like, here's a lot of honey. Um, and, like, and it opens you up, right? Like, you, it opens you up to a different idea uh, when you're laughing. And then you can act, it actually, it's like Richard Pryor or, like, you know, all these amazing comedians who have, like, a social lens inside of their comedy. Um, th I think slave play allows people to, like, actually hear the thing that's being said because they're laughing for so long. Yeah.